Hey YouTube, just gonna come at you today with a short video. Um, been real busy, just got back from Aquashella. Thanks to everybody that came out and uh, stopped by our booth at Aquashella. Uh, really appreciate your business, really appreciate um, your support, and it was just good to, to meet people, talk to people, meet people in person. But the reason I'm doing a video today is because of my wild caught umbi pair, Magnus and Beast. Let's take a look, I'll show you what happened. Got home from Aquashella, and I noticed that Beast and Magnus were being kind of playful with each other, and she was kind of colored up. Didn't think much of it because it happens quite often. Then yesterday, um, I came down and she was in the flower pot that you see her by over there, and she was doing a ton of head shaking, and they were, um, basically in breeding mode. They hadn't started yet, hadn't started spawning or anything, and I still kind of thought, well, they haven't bred for several years. I, I doubt anything will happen. And then I kind of forgot about it. Came down here today to feed the fish, and wouldn't you know it, thousands of eggs. <clears throat> this old pear still has it in them. I'm not gonna say these are gonna be successfully hatched and grown out. Look at her poor bad eye, it's been that way for a couple of years, but as you can see, there's a ton of eggs in there. So we're gonna keep our fingers crossed and we may have some F1 umbies from Magnus and Beast available, which is pretty much something that we had all kind of written off that wouldn't happen again. So, we're just gonna keep our eyes on them over the next few days, see if we get wigglers, and then see if we get free swimmers. Look at that clutch. Sorry, I got algae on the glass, um, but uh, she's, she's doing a good job of uh, protecting them, fanning them, that type of stuff. You can see her fins um, are a little beat up. I'm assuming that happened during the uh, pre-spawning process as they were probably getting pretty nasty with each other um, and I wasn't around to witness it because I was gone at Aquashella but at any rate I'm gonna keep this one real short thought I would just uh, fill anybody in that's interested um, all of you umby keepers out there this is a pretty big deal to me um, probably a pretty big deal to you to know that there is a potential for some Magnus and Beast fry to becoming available in the near future. Thanks everyone for watching. Uh, until next time. Later.